Hey guys, Tyler here once again with T-Game and Tech, and today I'm just going to show you some of the multitasking features that are found on iOS 5 Beta 1 for the iPad 2. So let's just get right to it. And I'll see the nice smart cover still works on iOS 5. It's always a good thing. Um, this isn't the background or anything that came with iOS 5. I just found this online because I accidentally replaced the original background and then I couldn't find it. For some reason, it's not located under wallpapers whenever you go to settings. Right into some wallpapers. Under wallpaper, there's nothing there. I don't know if that's a bug in iOS 5. I never really looked in iOS 4.3.3 because it didn't change my background until I went to iOS 5. So if anybody knows about that, just let me know in the comments below. So to get to your multitasking settings, you just go to under general and multitasking gestures, it says on or off. And under, sorry about that. Underneath it says use four fingers to five fingers to pinch home screen, swipe to reveal multitasking bar, swipe left to swipe left or right between apps. So we're just gonna get to trying it out and we're just gonna get try going to the home screen. And just like that. And to swipe up to get your multitasking bar, right there it is. So you can go back to settings. Um one nice thing about the returning to the home it's it goes as fast as your fingers go so you can like shrink it and you can see it shrinking and the home screen icons come in so that's really nice so let's just go to this timer app because there's no clock app in the iPad 2 which is or the iPad firmware in general which is really disappointing I don't know why Apple wouldn't include it I guess the reasoning I read somewhere was they have those kinda um, apps on mobile devices but whatever and this is a free app you can see the test advertisement at the bottom um, you can find it on the app store it's called timer and let's just try the swiping between apps um, if you swipe to the left this is the most recent app it kind of just bounces back to place if you swipe to the left you can see your recently used apps so that's really nice too and then like always back to pinch like that to go to home so I hope you guys like this short video on multitasking gestures um, Please remember just to keep watching the videos. Stay tuned for more. There'll be more iOS 5 videos. And thumbs up if you like my little angry bird here who's always in the corner of my videos. He's always creeping around like a little creeper, but oh well, he's awesome. Got him online at the Angry Bird, st bird store for like 11 bucks. You can't beat that if you love Angry Birds. So stay tuned for more video, guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.